Hi, welcome to Linux Show. In this video, I will show how to install custom kernels in Fedora Linux 39. Here we go. First, you need to download kernel source tarball from kernel.org. Here, you can download any of your choice. I am using stable kernel 6.8.3. Click here to download. Now run this command to extract your tarball. Now cd to the directory we extracted here. So now create a new directory called build. Uh, you can name it anything you want in which we will build our kernels. Now run this command to create a default configuration file like this. Now we need a configuration file for the kernel compiling. Uh, head over root file system like this and go to boot directory to where you can find this these files are configuration file we will use then paste it to the source tree in the bool directory then uh, delete this one and rename this uh, to dot config like this Then run this command to make menu config like this. Uh, you will see like this uh, this menu, and you can select uh, make changes in the configuration file like this. Then save it. Now uh, we are gonna make the actual kernels like this. Uh, this command make o equals build directory and dash j2. This is how many cores it will use, like four and eight. I am using two ok and press enter it will take uh, hours minutes uh, depend on your cpu now after uh, successful build we will install modules like this in a separate directory uh, like i made a directory called build and then Linux install in the home directory. So this command will install it inside this directory. Now modules are installed in this directory. Uh, you can directly install it to your system uh, with or uh, with this line install mode path you can remove this file and it will install this modules to your root directory with sudo command you, can, you, should, uh, you should put sudo uh, before make command and it will install it to the usr lib modules directory Now run this command to install Linux kernel image file and system map file. As you can see, uh, th those commands installed uh, yeah, these modules, lib modules, and these two files system map and vm lineage.
now we need to copy these modules files to the do directory like this in this directory user lib modules like this i already installed it and working now run this command to copy like this sudo cp dash r okay and mnt i'm using uh, virtual machine so it is look like that and mounted the file system to the boot share so it's uh, look like this install linux lib modules star then usr lib modules it will copy the all the files uh, this inside this directory like this then copy system.map file to the boot system boot directory like this with this command and then this is the version number of linux kernel 6.8.2 so it will this one uh, already installed then, then run this command copy this vm linux file to the boot directory vm linux and then uh, this is important 6.8.2 whatever your linux kernel version this it will show here like this now add kernel uh, to the boot run this command sudo kernel dash install add uh, kernel version number and this image uh, vm linux boot vm linux 6.8.2 my version is 6.8.2 it will add to the boot uh, group and it will at automatically boot into this kernel because it is higher number uh, so it will boot in you can select it on boot and the group menu after completing uh, without any error reboot the system So it completed. Uh, it booted fine. Let's see its version number. Type this command. As you can see, it is running 6.8.2. You can check this on about this system. You can see kernel version 6.8.2, which I installed, working fine. So. So that's it in the video like and subscribe see you in the next video